everybody, Mrs. Bodishan here. So today we're going to be answering the question, what is physical science? So that's kind of a loaded question. We need to first start off with the definition, right? So physical science is just a branch of natural science that studies non-living uh, systems. So I want to focus on that word non-living for a second because I get students year after year always asking me, are we going to dissect something this year? No, that would have to do with living systems, right? A living creature or living organism. So we're not studying anything that's alive this year. And I want you to keep that in mind throughout the year that we're not studying anything that's alive because um, there's some misconceptions that come into play later. Let me show you one of them. So the first part of physical science is chemistry. And chemistry is just a study of properties and behavior of matter. So in this, we're gonna be studying atoms, molecules, chemical properties, physical properties, and their changes. Um, so we get to study really cool things like um, explosions and seeing fireworks go off and understanding the science behind what makes them different colors and just really cool science, right? Everybody loves chemical reactions. Um, and we get to study the periodic table and all the elements that make it up. Um, now the living thing is, is what I'm coming back to and that's atoms and molecules. Um, some of my students just have the misconception that they're alive and so atoms and molecules are not living. Um, this is a non-living system study, okay? And then the second part of physical science is gonna be physics. And physics is just a study of matter, its motion and behavior through space and time. So physics is really awesome because we get to study all of Newton's laws of motion and kind of figure out why things move and groove the way they do and the science behind it. You're gonna understand gravity when you study physics. Um, you're gonna look at speed, velocity, acceleration, um, the electromagnetic spectrum, and you can just really understand a whole lot about the world around you and why everything is moving and understand its motion. So I hope this was helpful to you all. Thank y'all for watching. If you all are studying physical science this year, I have tons of videos to help you out through your entire school year. Go ahead and check them out. Subscribe to my channel to see all the new ones that I continually post. Thank y'all for watching. Bye everybody.